Hello, everybody. Let's talk about C A or I'm sorry, C D Z I, Cadiz Inc. Who are they? Why have they flopped so drastically? And and why is my scanner going off on the RSI Daily showing this uh, maybe fully exhausted? So let's take a look here. Uh, it was uh, it's in California, United States, and uh, it owns uh, sustainable water and agriculture projects so it has 70 square miles of property uh with a significant water resource so that's good to see uh we need water and uh it's something we're gonna always use so they had a an 8k filing report back on the 26th of march and uh they also talked about uh, uh unusual uh, stock uh, trading uh, right in here, 220-mile uh, pipeline uh, that travels through the San Bernardino and Kern counties. Uh, maybe a lawsuit or something with that, but uh, it's hard to say for sure until you read the whole article. But just wanted to look to see if there was anything significant. Why this thing is holding back? I'm not really seeing a lot. Uh, right now so why is the chart going off okay now I looked at this chart earlier and saw this huge curly Q and, and the MACD is starting to recover it looks like it looks like all systems are going we got green volume we got big pintails and uh, let's see if we can get this thing back to eleven dollars where it is look at all that buying in at eleven dollars people last time it hit the RSI that low uh, it seemed to rebound every time. Look at this. Boom. Even this pintail. If you had a, uh, an order to buy right in here, it probably would have picked you up right in there. Boom. And uh, But look at this big jump in here. The RSI stayed down for a while. Was there any big loops in here? No, I don't see like we see here. So I'm definitely going to keep an eye on this one and uh, see where it's headed. Let's take a look at what's going on on the 15-minute is there anything significant we can see? Any details? Uh, a little bit of high volume here and there. 100% uh, buy. Um, it's hard to tell if it's completely rebounding. We get a lot of buying below the level right now, helping probably push it push it up to a new high uh, from where it's at right now. So let's take a look at just one last thing: the, the two-minute, and then also some of these fun indicators. Wow, 16,000 buy orders. That's huge. There's 15,000 at price probably. Uh, it's hard to tell. These are these red ones are sell orders. Uh, the white are at at whatever the price is, and then we got people paying a premium here in the green. Uh, it's busted through the VWAP huge and has continued upward here on the 15-minute charts. Uh, looking at these indicators, a lot of green here. Uh, this one's a 15-second chart, so we're showing the last bit of time here. Uh, there was a, a big amount of, of volume people buying and will it continue to go up that's what we'll have to look and see but look at even right in here a lot of buying at this level huge so uh, CDZI something to, to try to look for in the immediate future uh, 15 second chart a lot of buying look at a huge buying at that level that was probably that uh, 16,000 order right in there boom at uh, nine dollars and twenty-seven cents, and yep, yeah, look at that, nine twenty-seven, right on the money. Um, it looks like it's starting to cross over. We'll see if more money gets pulled in here, uh, and maybe push this one back up to where it needs to be. And so, where does it need to be? Probably where it was before it dumped. It's like a big dump there. So, looking at a price, uh, maybe there's a lot of bag holders at eleven twenty. Uh, waiting for this thing to come back up and hit some new highs. Um, definitely going to put this one on the list to keep an eye out for. So best of luck. Hope you have some great trades out there and have a great day. Take care.